Have you ever had a hangover? Maybe. Well, the pain is due to inflammation in the brain. You may reach for a bottle of aspirin and talk to yourself, one, we need better drugs, and two, where did these little white pills come from? Well, it may surprise you, but most of the drugs we use today were originally derived from natural sources. Aspirin, for example, from willow bark. Mother Nature is a master medicinal chemist. Through millions of years of evolution, she's equipped organisms, such as sea sponges on the ocean floor, with an arsenal of molecules that they use to protect themselves against bacteria, fungi, and hungry fish. Recently, scientists are studying whether any of these molecules could be used to treat human diseases. Now, inside of human cells, there's an intricate network of pathways that work together to regulate cell function. Some are stimulatory in green, while others are inhibitory in red. In inflammatory diseases, things have gone amok, and like a car with a gas pedal stuck to the floor, the green stimulatory pathways are out of control, and the activated immune cells cause damage to normal, healthy tissues. More than one in every four Canadians suffers from a form of inflammatory disease, such as arthritis, asthma, or heart disease. The drugs that we have to stop inflammatory cells aren't ideal, and have many side effects and other cell types. So as a way to discover better treatments for inflammatory diseases, our lab focuses on the red, inhibitory proteins, which comprise the breaking system of the cell. And chief among them is a protein called CHIP, which is only found in immune cells. Now, when one works on a protein called CHIP, one has to enunciate very carefully. So part of my PhD work included developing a way of turning on CHIP, the equivalent of applying the cell's own natural breaks to treat inflammatory diseases. So we screened a library of sea sponge extracts for potent and specific activators of SHIP and identified a molecule from a Papua New Guinea sea sponge. Excitingly, our drug candidate exceeded all of our expectations. It potently inhibits immune cells cultured in the lab. It does nothing to cells that don't have SHIP, thus the action of our drug is restricted only to immune cells. It reverses inflammation in animal models of inflammatory disease and allergy, and it's currently in phase one clinical trials in humans. In summary, we've discovered a new treatment for inflammatory diseases, and our drug promises to have fewer side effects than the currently available drugs. So hopefully, one day soon, when you have a headache or something worse, you can reach for a bottle of shit activator and think to yourself, holy shit, thank goodness for Mother Nature's system. <laughs>